Bucky and Yujiro are a father and son with a pretty unusual relationship which includes hate, violence, love, anger and even death. The latest season ended with the father and son fight, the greatest fight of the whole series so far, but this was not the first one of their encounters. So in this video let's remember Bucky and Yujiro's story that led us to their epic fight. Since his birth Bucky has been training so that he may one day surprise his father Yujiro and earn his love. Bucky's mother Amy Akazawa made sure that he had the most advanced training equipment around. She has provided him throughout his life with the best martial arts teachers, personal gym trainers and sports equipment that money can buy. Bucky eventually became famous in his hometown as the most feared punk around as he beat up all the thugs he could find. This caused all the other thugs to graffiti all over his house because they could not hurt him physically. At some point he grew his strength and self-confidence that he challenged the strongest Yakuta in Japan, Kaoru Hanayama to a fight. And during their fight Yujiro made his first appearance. He appears when both fighters have finished their fight. Yujiro ridicules them and states that this battle should not end yet since they are both alive. The provoked Hanayama attacks Yujiro but he can't do anything. Baki tries to help his rival but is knocked out with one blow by his father. Eventually Hanayama was almost destroyed by the strongest man in the world. He easily knocks Hanayama out stating that he only lost his time to meet such weaklings. Another father and son encounter is after Yujiro goes to the mountains and kills Yashazaru, an ape whom Baki befriended. Yujiro is meeting with Baki during the boy's training. He shows him the head of a dead monkey and Baki goes crazy. Yujiro managed to provoke his son and desperate Baki tries to attack him. His father stops him and says he wants to fight him next month. What a father. Also, there was an interesting scene. Bucky defeated Gaia, the master of the battlefield, during his preparation for a fight against his father. When Yujiro finds out about that, he decides to do something much better than his son did. He calls the Prime Minister of Japan and says he'll be here in an hour to kill him. Then he really shows up at the Prime Minister's mansion and defeats a huge number of guards on his own and then he shows up in the Prime Minister's room but Yujiro only breaks his death. He tells him that he should take better care of his protection and then he leaves. It looks like Yujiro was impressed by Bucky's feet and decided that he also needed to do something impressive before their fight to keep up. When the day of the father and son fight comes, Bucky starts to warm up at uh, midday and the fight is to take place at midnight. And all of his friends arrived to cheer him up. Later Yujiro arrives by helicopter at the dual scene, accompanied by Bucky's mother Amy. The big match starts with an unexpected earthquake, Yujiro stops it by hitting the ground. Just normal stuff for the strongest creature in the world. Bucky tries not to worry about this unusual show of strength and attacks his father. Bucky does his best during a fight but is unable to cause any serious damage to his father. Yujiro is still very satisfied with the level of his son and happily announced to Amy that today he will eat a delicious dish. So after a few counterattacks, Bucky's body is crushed into the ground and Yujiro begins to bombard him with a series of blows to his face when the young fighter is lying unconscious. When he is almost killed by his own father, Amy enters the duel. For the first time she defends her son and attacks Yujiro with her fist, stopping him from further attacking their son. Her act of courage saves Bucky's life, but unfortunately Amy is murdered by her beloved, who embraces her and breaks her spine. Later Bucky decides to go on a long journey to meet powerful opponents to fight. That's when he swears to himself seriously that someday he will defeat his father. After traveling around the world for two years, Bucky returned as a strong 15 years old dude, even his hair changed color for some reason. Bucky begins to fight at the underground arena, defeating a lot of powerful opponents. During Bucky's fight against Mount Toba, Yujiro suddenly entered the arena. Bucky is furious at the sight of his father because this is their first meeting in a very long time. He rushes at him impulsively, but Yujiro effortlessly knocks out Bucky. 
Later he comes to see his sons fight against Kureha Shinogi. At some point uh, it seems that Baki has lost uh, and then Kureha provokes Yujiro to come down to the arena. Yujiro accepts the offer and comes to him, but then Baki rises up and tells his father to not interfere. The ogre looks at Baki's fighting position and guesses what technique his son will want to use. He wishes him good luck and leaves the ring. This time it looks like he is not so brutal to Baki after all. Sometime later the maximum tournament started and Yujiro came to see of course. During the tournament Yujiro meets Jack Hama. When uh, Jack wins uh, his fight in the first round, Yujiro goes into the arena to talk to him. Both fighters are almost starting to fight, but uh, they're interrupted by jealous Baki. The ogre throws him aside with one blow, so he won't stop them. After a while, Jax walks up to Yujiro and tells him something that makes Yujiro very happy. After a while, the ogre announces that Jack has very right to fight him. Yeah, he said to him that he is his son. Before Baki's fight with Kaio Retsu, Yujiro comes to talk to his son's opponent. And he tells him he should be afraid of his fight. During the battle, Yujiro watches his son brutality and hopes that Retsu will awake the true Hanma spirit in Baki. However, ultimately, Baki does not kill Retsu, even though he is very close. After the fight, Yujiro meets Baki and tells him that he is disappointed because of his son's delicacy. <laughs> As the father, Yujiro wants Baki to become stronger. He even comes to his son during his snoo snoo session with his girlfriend and encourages Baki and Gozue to have sex as many times as possible in order to make Baki stronger. The father and son relationship began to look more like a real father and son during the Right Eye tournament, when both of them were watching fights and talking like a family. But of course, Baki was sent flying through the wall before that. Later, after Bucky's fight against Ali Jr., Bucky finally realized he is ready to end his quarrel with Yujiro, challenging him for a final battle and declaring he does not want to be the strongest anymore, he just wants to beat his father. Yujiro gets excited and recognizes Bucky as his prey, leaving the arena. An interesting question, when Yujiro was teaching small kid Bucky to fight, did he also see him as a prey? Um, so that was everything that happened in Baki's and Yujiro's relationship before their final fight. Baki forgot why he hates his father so much and Yujiro admitted that he actually feels love towards his son. Also after their final fight, Yujiro admitted Baki as his equal and the strongest in the world, uh, on the same level as Yujiro himself. As we can see, their relationship transformed from hate and anger to some kind of love between father and son. What do you think about Baki and Yujiro's story? Leave your comments down below. If this video was interesting to you, leave a like and subscribe for more. Thank you all for watching, see you in the next video. For today, I am out. Bye. Look like from corruption, they're not benefit.